I'm Amira David and here are your headlines from 7 Action News. A police officer was shot on Sunday night in the city of Monroe. The officer was responding to a potential carjacking in the area of 2nd and Winchester, according to police. The responding officer spoke with the victim who said two men struck her over the head with a handgun and left the scene in her blue sedan. Officers then found the stolen vehicle at North Dixie Highway and Turnus Drive. Two suspects are now in custody. The police officer is recovering at a Toledo hospital in stable condition. Richard Worshi Jr., better known as White Boy Rick, will be released from a Florida halfway house on July 20th, a month early, according to the state's Departments of Corrections, where she was sentenced to serve five years in prison in Florida after being convicted on racketeering and conspiracy to commit racketeering charges in 2006. He began serving his sentence in Florida following his release from a Michigan prison. Previously, court records indicated he would be released in August. Oakland County Sheriff's deputies arrested a man who took off from the scene of a car crash on a skateboard. The 43 year old man initially crashed his car into a telephone pole near West Huron and Dakota Street in Pontiac. Deputies say when they showed up at the man's home, not far from the crash site, and saw the skateboard outside, the man swung a tire and charged at a deputy who tased him. Another deputy showed up to help arrest the man and later found dozens of suspected opioid pills in his car. Charges are currently pending and he's scheduled to be arraigned on Tuesday. All right, let's get a quick check on the forecast with Mike Taylor. For tonight, temps are going to be in the 60s, mostly clear with a chance of fog by the morning.